Hello there guys, welcome back to a short online tutorial. Today we're based in Adobe Photoshop and it's your good friend Jack from Blue Sky Graphics back again to show you some really cool stuff. What I would like to do today guys is show you how to create this cutout effect as you can see on this lady's face. This part of the skin here looks like it's actually cut out and protruding from this lady's uh, face. All I've done is applied some shadowing underneath. A really cool idea that you can use across many forms of graphic design. And what I want you to do today is take what I show you and implement them into your designs to really create some really professional and amazing looking pieces. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is take our top layer there and just scroll down, press shift and click on this adjustment layer and press backspace to delete and start off with the original image. Now what I wanna do is because of this image is smart objects, I'm just gonna simply come through and rasterize the image. And now I'm gonna use our curvature tool here. So I'm gonna create a shape probably around this, sort of way like the size maybe put one there maybe let's put one there and we'll come through here and i'm going to say we'll do a sort of a shape like so there okay so with this path still live what i'm going to do now is right click on it and make a selection and i don't want any feather radius on this so i'm going to keep this down uh can keep the feather radius to zero percent okay then what i'm going to do is jump onto my marquee tool here Right click on the selection and have this option here of layer via cut. So if I now come through and press layer via cut, you can see now this layer has been cutted. So if I use the move tool and I come through and move that there, like so, we've now got the basis of our shape. But what we need to do now is really sort of like add some elements to the shape just to give it that sort of sense of depth and a bit of realism to it. So I'm going to double click on the layer here to bring up our layer style. And I'm going to apply an outer glow. I want to apply a drop shadow as well. And what I want to do is come through and apply a bevel and boss just to give it that nice um, sort of rounded edge to it. Yes, if you can come through and manipulate all the options here, but I like the, the options that I've chosen already. And I'm going to press OK. And then as you can see, we've got that sort of transparent pack, uh, pattern in the background there. So I want to add sort of a solid color adjustment layer. So I'm going to come through and adjustment layers, add solid color. Let's go for sort of a sort of light already kind of color. And we'll bring that layer to the top there. And as you can see, we have created that cutout effect quite easily in Adobe Photoshop. If you're interested in finding out more about the school, the courses that we offer, please take a look at our website at blueskygraphics.co.uk. Thank you very much, guys. Take care and I'll see you next time.